probably look like a boy with my hair like this but good morning everyone welcome back to my vlog I am actually it is a Saturday I am going to pick blueberries with a friend um, I like to do this to have them stacked up I can freeze them and then pull them out for my smoothies which is super nice um, so I am headed there it's 7 a.m. and they open at 8 so we're gonna pick right away um, and then I'm going to the farmers market and running a couple extra errands so I'm just gonna take you all along with me and show you a day in the life and um, yeah let's get to it so of course I did bring my cup of coffee I have old coffee here I have some money um, my mask of course and then I do have some mail to mail out for some of my clients I brought my microfactor and um, a couple supplements that I take after my breakfast and then I did bring oats and I'll just go microwave these probably at a gas station or something um, but super quick easy simple and then of course I have my water so I have to drive about 45 minutes, so we're going to get to it and enjoy our coffee on the way. Okay, so this is the place Potter and Sun. It is in Wisconsin Rapids and it's pick your own blueberries. Super excited for this experience. I am just leaving now. It was so much fun. I just picked one um, big container of it and um, we're calling it a day because it is raining but we at least got one full package in. So I am super excited for it and now I'm going to go off to the farmer's market. Usually when I'm on the go I like to pack a quick simple breakfast. So I did oats with protein powder and then I did some hemp seed and almond butter for some healthy fats. And then um, I actually did top it with some fresh blueberries that I just picked, um, which was super good in there. And I clearly dug in already. I took my macro factor already. Um, these are just my essential nutrients that I take every single day with um, one meal. And I just typically do it with breakfast if I can because it's just most convenient for me. Um, so this is just my little breakfast on the go. I'm going to the farmer's market now and I'm gonna drink the rest of my coffee here. My hair is a hot mess from the rain that we got <laughs> picking blueberries, but I'm at the farmer's market now, so I'm gonna go pick up a few things, um, a few pieces of produce, and then I think I'm gonna head to Aldi, grab a couple things just to last me through this next week for meal prep, and I will show you what I get. Okay, so all I got from Aldi was this salad kit again. Again, I don't do the dressing, but it's super good. Love the greens. I did dates because I couldn't find any at the health food store. Fresh turkey and a can of garbanzo beans for a salad I'm going to show later on in the video. You guys already saw what I got from Aldi. Um, that's just right here. And then I was going to show what I got from the farmer's market. I did microgreens, um, some broccoli shoots, and then I did a fresh bundle of basil, some green onion, and then I did tomatoes and cucumbers. I'm gonna make a salad with um, all the fresh greens that I got as well as garbanzo beans. And I'm gonna share that right now. Making this fresh produce balsamic salad mix, I found it on Instagram from, I believe her Instagram handle name is Dana Dines. The Instagram handle right here. Um, so you can check her out. She I went to school with her in dietetics. She has so many great recipes on her Instagram. So I have all of my ingredients here. I'm gonna chop everything up, put it in the bowl, and I will show you everything that I'm gonna put in here. Okay, so first I just chopped up a bunch of green onion. As we can see here, I didn't measure. I just kind of eyeballed and put in what I wanted in here. 
cucumber and tomato are chopped up now, so I am going to mix that in with the green onion. Fresh basil, I washed up and I chopped a little bit, and I'm gonna put it in my bowl and mash it so it brings out all of the extra flavor, and then I'll add it to the rest of the bowl. I dished some out from this big pan over to my little bowl here. I'm gonna top it with a fourth cup of chickpeas, and then I am also gonna do balsamic vinegar on top with a little bit of sea salt. This is the end result. I am going to mix everything in with the balsamic vinegar, mix in the sea salt and chickpeas, and I will let you know how it is. My hair is still crazy, but I'm gonna try my first bite of this salad. So good, the basil, I could never have enough, so super tasty. As always, thank you so much for stopping in on my channel. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Please like and subscribe, follow me on Instagram here. <laughs> I'll see you guys in my next one, bye guys. Mm -hmm.